Yeah, it was a great it fun. It was a great fun. Great fun, really. Yeah, that school is so. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Las. I travel around schools in many countries and I watch what happens there. I spent last days in the Czech Republic. That Petr Bezruč Elementary School in Trinets is so funny. Do you want to know what happened there? If so, follow me, follow me, follow me. It is the last day of March. It means that tomorrow is April Fool's Day. Because the nine class children are in their last year at school, they decided to make this year's April Fool's Day a big event. They started to talk it over the day before. So, any ideas? Let's lock teachers up in the staff room and flood the school out. Are you joking? Real ideas, okay? Mm, we can phone the teachers and tell them they oh won God, 1 million no. euros. Nope, let's put laxative in their drinks. Are you normal? That's a bit much. Look, we have only one day, so let's think about it and stop fooling about. Hey, I have an idea. We can talk it over with the caretaker, come to school one hour earlier, and hide ourselves in the attic. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. Yes, and in the meantime we could steal tests from the staff room. Good idea, and we can also move to bell time. The confusion will be bigger. Yeah. Okay. 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 They all agreed and divided the work for tomorrow. Me, Andrew, John and Adele will go to the staff room. Someone will steal tests and I will take chairs apart. Me, Teresa and Prokop will move the bell time half an hour backwards. Me and Misha will prepare the attic, take keys and set up hidden cameras. Day D is here. The students met behind the school in the morning and got ready to start. The caretaker let them in. Both the students and the caretaker kept the secret, of course. Everybody set to work. Let's meet in front of the attic door at half past six. Bye. Five minutes later in the staff room. Hey, let's gather the pile of tests. Look, our latest test. I want to know my mark. No, we don't have time. You had better take the chairs apart. What? No, I won't take them apart. Why? You can do it. No, you. Okay, I will do it. Oh my god. The chairs were taken apart, the tests were scattered. In the meantime, the next group started setting up hidden cameras across the school. So, um, we can hide the cameras next to the stairs and in the staff room. Okay, I'll take the staff room and don't forget the keys. The last group went to the caretaker. They moved the bell time 60 minutes backwards. Caretaker, just one thing please. You don't know anything about our plan, okay? Okay. Only 10 minutes were left before the meeting in front of the attic door. Hurry up to the attic! I've seen some of the teachers coming. The students ran towards the attic with all the tests in their hands. Everyone was confused. Is everyone here? Probably yes. Yes, we are here. We too. The caretaker promised. She won't say a word. Look, I can see Mr. Novak arriving. A 
A few minutes later, Clara realized that she could finally look at her test. She was very eager to know what mark she got. Hey, who has the test? I want to see mine. Oh my god, why do you care about it now? I want to know my mark. Anyway, I think we'll have problems. Relax, it's just April Fool's Day. Can you finally pass me the test, please? I want to see my test too. We can as well hand out all the tests. Do you think they will be angry? Mm, I don't know at all. Do you have my test, guys? I can't find it. No, but it can't just disappear. Oh no! They stopped thinking about it and decided to look at the cameras. Oh my god! They're coming to the staff room! Look at their faces! She is taking a seat! She is looking for the test! She won't find them! Test? We forgot! Look here, at this camera. Something is lying on the floor in the hallway. It must be the tests. Really? How come you haven't noticed that they got lost? Sorry, but it was a big chaos. We had to hurry up to the attic. Don't scream. I will go and bring them. What? Are you normal? No way. They could see you. Don't you get it? Don't worry. I'll be careful. I promise. In the end, they decided to try it, but... Hey, I can't open the door. What? what? You must push the handle down. I'm not kidding, seriously, you can try it. Mm. Somebody locked us up. No, 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 no. And it was true. At the same time, in the staff room, two teachers were talking about the revenge. You won't believe. When I was going to the office, I saw some students running towards the attic. So I took the keys and locked them up there. Hmm. When I asked the caretaker, she denied everything. But anyway, I saw through her. So, what now? It's our turn now. Let's teach them a lesson. I've got an idea. The students were impatiently waiting in the attic when the door suddenly opened. Yeah, you, you found us. What a coincidence. No, no, it's late, dear students. You all will be punished and forget about the school trip. What? what? Bad luck. No, no, no one could understand it. It was April Fool's Day, so where was the problem? Some students cried when they were leaving the attic. I don't get it. It was just prank. We carried it too far. No, I can't tell it to my parents. They will kill me. I'm not kidding. And what about the future? The secondary schools won't enroll us. A few minutes later, teachers came to the classroom. Hey students, April Fool! Yes. 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 Yes.